Yo, what is the guy? My name regrets and bring out in the video. Um, these are an older pickup that uh, that happened at SneakerCon, uh, a video I posted before this one. Um, so I just wanted to show you what I picked up because I never said anything or talked in that video of what I actually got at SneakerCon. So this is actually what I um, picked up over there. Now, if you think these are fake, um, because the missile being black, these are actually custom. I mean, they're not custom a lot, but they're actually custom. So I traded, it was out, yeah, it was actually for a trade. So I traded my Raptor 7s. I did a review on that. And if you saw the condition that they were in, this is, this is, was a legit, like, I won that trade. So since he's a customizer, I guess it wouldn't matter to him. He was just like fixing himself. So I'm gonna just point out the things he actually customized, which is pretty obvious. Um, he actually customized or added the Yeezy lace tips on tip of the shoes, what I thought were a really, really nice touch. And then he, I, I didn't realize till after um, I got home that the missile were painted. Cause I haven't seen these in a long time. So I thought that the missile was like actually black, but um, reality was actually white. So if you want to look at the carbon fiber real quick, these are legit. Yeah. So. And uh, the insole was still intact. I taped it. The size tag kind of faded, but it doesn't really matter. It doesn't came with a, or I didn't get a box of it, or nor did he get a box of mine. So. Um, he actually had, uh, what you call it, custom Fire Fives, which is like pretty much an all black Fire Five with like the lace holder or the, uh, the, what you call it, the lace, the lace loops painted in red and the white part, which is the upper mini painted black. So I had an option between those and these and I chose these because one of them I think looks a lot cleaner. The way he did, because he he also added the gold lace tip to the other ones, so I was like, I wasn't really feeling them. And then over there, I, I got the the Nike pin, which I think matched well with the gold. So, oh yeah, these are just your typical snakeskin lows. First custom, I would say, not a huge custom, but. I mean, it's still custom. And I got a pickup coming in today, which I've been waiting for this whole time. One of my grails and one of the shoes are actually gonna release again. And maybe I'll do an unboxing, or if not, I'll just review the shoes. And that's about it. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.